Hey guys, it's Calum here. Welcome back to Fable Anniversary. We are at part number 10. And uh, where we left off last video, we beat down Twinblade. We didn't kill him, but we made him look a bit foolish. So we're, we're pretty badass now. And um, where, uh, what's different from this very last one? Uh, I got a lot, a lot, a lot of money. And I did a little trick. Not sure if it's cheating. I wouldn't classify it as cheating. Uh, best way to make money, which I um I made a video on that. So if you want to know how to make money very easily and very quickly, check out that video. Uh, I think it's going to be before this one anyway. So check that out. And that's why I've got this sweet new set of armor, which is pretty damn good right now. And uh, I changed my button layout a bit actually as well to kind of suit doing more will stuff because I was really only using one will attack because I don't know. I had the um, Fable Two stick layout instead of the original Fable, which is way more useful because you can hold right trigger and then you can choose your wheel attack. So I got um, what have I got? I can't remember what I picked up, but um, I can show you in the next bit. So yeah, I got some of that. I got lots of upgrades and now I have lots of money. So I'm pretty much set to just just go through all these quests as quickly as possible and be good instead of dying all the time. So the thing with the wheel uh, upgrade which I got, uh, when you get hit. It actually doesn't take damage off your health, it takes it off your will. So I got a heap of will potions. I can't remember exactly what it's called. I'm probably sounding very silly right now. Um, what is the upgrade called? I'm sure I'll know it as soon as I look at it. Uh, yeah, physical shield. This is what is actually probably really, really helpful. But it's good, it's a protective shield that knocks will, so your mana, instead of your health, which is a lot easier, I think. And it's just, it's pretty cool. So um, we're gonna go find a mission, or well, a quest, to um, where are we going exactly? We need to go find Maze, and uh, he's got something for us. So we're gonna be much better equipped to do all these missions now that I've actually upgraded properly, compared to just kind of guessing what I'm doing. That's why I waited a couple of days before I'm recording this, compared to my last part, just to kind of get a better feel, because I was rushing a bit. So now I feel like I'm more equipped to be pretty cool. I think he's above us. So let's go up here and see what Maze wants from us. Let's get a quest going. Here he is. So, you really found your sister? <laughs> I'd never have imagined her living among bandits. You've really come a long way these last few years, haven't you? People are starting to ask when they'll see you in the arena out in Witchwood. But before you go wandering again, I've left a quest card of my own. A favor, if you will. An old friend of mine has gone missing. Calls himself the Archaeologist. He may have stumbled onto something big. Perhaps big enough to put his life in danger. There's a rumor that he may be hiding somewhere in Witchwood. That is, if he isn't dead already. You can use a Cullis gate to get there. I only hope it isn't too late. Do do do. Okay. A new quest card. I have a new quest card. Where? All right. So the archaeologist. I think I remember this quest, but I'm not sure entirely. So, oh yeah. So I've changed the button layout. So I'm going to be holding A when I'm meant to be holding B. That's why most of the time I'll be not running because I'll keep forgetting. But I remember then, so we're we're okay. So we'll get to the uh, the world map. And uh, pick this quest up. So I'm completely stocked with um, health potions and also nice will potions, so I don't have to worry too much about my stuff. Well, I think we should talk to the guildmaster. To meet the archaeologist. Okay. <laughs> that was strange. Sorry, that was too close to my mouth. All right. Um, which one is it? Which is the archaeologist one? It's not this one, not this one. Trader Massacre. Apparently those are none of them. Maybe we just need to go to the Colors Gate. That's what it said anyway. I thought I would have had to pick up the quest, but I guess it already gave it to me. Uh, so Witchwood, right? That's what he wanted. Yep, yeah, we're pretty close. So let's get over there. Let's go save some archaeologists. Indiana Jones style. So is Witchwood, it's on its own little island. I don't even remember... Have I been to Witchwood before? I don't think I have been in this game so far. So I'm not sure why the Colors Gate's already open. 
strange. I thought you had to go to location to open the Carl's Gate. Anyway, let's stop questioning it. I get 1,200 gold, which is basically nothing to me now, ever since I've made so much money. You know how much I've got? I've got like 200,000 now. There is a sword that only a true hero can acquire. Ah, a sword, I remember that. Oh, so we need to get our weapon out before. Oh, that's, um... Some gods can be fickle. That's the Avo, the, the place of Avo, which if you donate enough money, I think it's like a hundred thousand, you get like the best sword in the game, I'm pretty sure. It's I think it's one of the best. What's all lightning going on here? Alright, so I'm going to put my physical shield on, and now I should be good to go. Now I've got a different roll button as well, which is going to make my life a little bit harder. Because I changed it all, and this is my first time actually playing it with um, any actual changes. So I might be a bit rusty, but I've never been that good anyway, so we'll be fine. Not even taking off that much damage. I thought this was a better weapon than it is. Very slow. So the good thing about this um, physical shield is it only takes off um, mana when you get hit. Like It's not like it's draining it while having it on, which is pretty cool. But it's the first time you put it on, you lose a little bit of mana, but not enough to affect me in any way. This thing's gonna go down pretty soon. I've lost zero health, which is pretty cool. I'm doing okay. Much better than my first time fighting a troll. Which was not very good at all. I got good speed right now, which is pretty helpful, so. Oh god. Okay. It's gonna go down any second. Oh yeah, so I've got one of the um age of potions, which is uh, when you get a good combat multiplier, you use it and then you basically get way more experience than if you didn't have a good combat multiplier. So I'll save it for when I have like a really good combat multiplier and then we'll just get heaps of XP. I know there's a way you can kind of trick the game in this to get like an epic combat multiplier and then like you've got, you can just get upgrades like super easily, but we'll, uh, we'll try and do it properly. I'm not sure what my best combat multiplier is so far. That was only 15. I'm hoping I get to like 20 or something. I think there's achievement uh, linked with that. I think if you have a 20 multiplier, um, you can get an achievement using one of those potions. Um, I turned the um, physical shield off just because it's an annoying sound when you have it on all the time. Let's talk to this thing. You just go to a demon duck. Is this my first time talking to a demon duck? I could have sworn I'd talk to I only before. open to those who know my name. If you know it, find and hit the magic stones to spell it out. Only one person knows my name, but I doubt you'll find him, even at the Temple of Avo. Even at the Temple of Avo. So we'll go to the temple, and I bet we're going to have to, like, put some decent amount of money in. So with the little money trick I got, money isn't that big a deal to me at this stage, so I can pretty much... Um, put as much money in as I'd like. I think you have to put a hundred thousand in to get that epic weapon. So these are the um, stones that spelled his name. I don't have a clue what his name is. S. H. H. D. D. I. S. H. D. I. I'm assuming that's not his name. Um, I know you could uh, probably just guess it, but I don't know. So where is the temple then? I'm actually not that sure. I've, I don't think we've passed it. Had we passed it in the last little bit? I don't remember. Let's see if I got it right. I don't. I assume I haven't. I only opened nope. only one. Okay, I think either we need to backtrack or do we go ahead? Well, the um, guildmasters mentioned the temple in the last area, so maybe we should um, see if it's there. Probably wasting my own time here, but we'll have to check it out. Because I don't really remember where the temple is. So, it's all about investigation.
I'm sure this is a quite a quick mission for those who know his name. What was it? S H D and I? I don't know. Okay. It is. I think this. Is this the temple of. Ever? What is this? This looks creepy. Nothing here? What is this thing? <coughs> bam, bam. Okay. That was nothing. Let's go back then. Sorry for the waste of time. There's bandits here, but ah, they're not going to make any damage. Okay. What's the best way to do this? I'm sure we're going to go to the temple, so we'll figure it out. Loading screens, though, right? These things are slow. That's the one thing with um, Lionhead. They still have loading screens in all their games. They don't have anything different, like Fable 3. How many loading screens did that game have? Too many. Okay. Should we do this one more guess before we go there? Just see if I can just like knock it out of the park with a guess? I don't know. Is it even worth it? Let's go with H, first letter, because I remember that being H. Let's go with this one. What was this I one? S that won't be a name. T-H-I-S-T <laughs> That's not a real name. Okay. S oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Still pressing A when I'm meant to be holding B. Okay, let's go up here. And maybe we'll find this so-called Temple of Avo. Guess I think it's around here, right? Here we go. I was going the right way. I just I was second guessing myself, but we've made it. So hopefully these people will give me some uh, answers. I'm sure I'm gonna have to donate a crap load of money. Well, it might not be crap load for me anymore because it's good. I like having lots of money. Don't have to worry. Okay, so. Is this... Hello. Who are you? Hello there. Are you interested in hearing the name of the demon door? Indeed. If you can give me something valuable, I might tell you it. Something red and shiny, for example. Otherwise, you'll just have to work it out for yourself. He's the only person. Let's just give it to him. That's right? not what I'm looking for. I want a rare star... What did I just give you then? Okay, let's not just hand him things without looking. Did he want a ruby then? Equipment, right? Is that good? Is that good enough for you? That's a lot of money. But I got. See, look, look at me, those I got. Um, ruby. Let's give you one of those. A sign? Let's just assign it to. No, I don't want to do this. Let's just use it, right? Will use it mean I use it or will I give it to him? I know the doll's secret oh, right. name. It's Hits. H. Hits. I don't believe you. Need a good sort of fight beside you. I just, for some reason, I don't believe him. I don't know why. Should we just go investigate? Good day, hero. If you need someone to fight evil by your side, I'm your man. Ah, I'll be good. Very well. You know where to fight. Yes, I do. Okay, let's go back there. It's hits, according to that guy. But that guy seemed to leave in a bit of a hurry once I gave him one of my rubies, which, hmm, I'm not that happy about. Seems to be up to no good. We'll, 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 we'll see. Hits is a pretty strange name. I don't think it's... Maybe I'm just doubting the common man because I'm some kind of hero. Hits, you say. Hits. All right. Alright, so that's H. H. Is this I? It is. I. Which one's this? This is the S. So, this is the T. T. Let's see if this is right. H. I. T. S. Hits. Looks right to me. So, you worked out my name. Big deal. In you go. He ain't happy about it, is he? Thank you, Demon Door. Well, that only cost one ruby. What was that, about 500? Worth about 500? Eh, I'll be fine. I'll be good. Did we get the ruby from killing the troll? 
That would have made sense. So, you found me. That's just grand. If you can find me, so can they. I should never have started studying the focus sites. But how was I to know Jack was interested in them too? Yes, Jack of Blades. Look, I have no time to explain. You can read my journal if you want. I don't want it anymore. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll be off. It's not safe for me here anymore. Thanks to you. Well, there you go. Quest completed. That guy was not that happy to see me, but he mentioned a name, Jack of Blades. We all know what that means. And if you don't, I'm sure you'll figure it out soon. We'll leave it here, guys, before... Let's check if we can get up in this chest. See what's in here. Some goodies? <laughs> not really. Uh, Chainmail's actually okay. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please leave a like and a comment. Tell me you think. And subscribe. We've got more of these coming out soon. And uh, please check out the video of the money-making technique if you're interested. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks, guys. Check the guild for more quests.